Hello everyone, welcome back. Uh, tonight we'll be looking at the energies of who will be born for you and we're talking about the week from the 8th till the 14th of uh, November 2021. Okay, so let's see where I go. Let's see. We'll get deeper into your energy for this week. And um, after this, we'll uh, follow the um, lovers and the king of cups for you. Yes, I wish it for you from the bottom of my heart. So I will say that um, after this, we'll uh, follow the mid of November reading, the December, and we're going to have an extended and uh, in-depth reading for 2020. Okay, let's see. I'm glad that you are going to have it. So, uh, let's see this uh, week's uh, energies. Now it's time for your stability. Now it's time to um, stop playing, stop being playful and not know what to do. Because when you are, I will not say playful, no. I, um, it's not even indecisive, you know. You just have a, a tendency to enjoy, you know, just a little bit. Yes, to play a little bit, okay, inside of you, because probably you're starting feeling better or will start feeling better. But uh, this sometimes uh, not going from this side, not going from the other side, being in the middle and playing here and there, maybe can cause you to be uh, a little bit stagnant. But what I see is that now, now is the divine timing for you to be finally, finally, very stable and uh, that stability includes also uh, financial stability emotional uh, security safety uh, I like it let's see the, the ace of cups what can I say to you what can I say to you here are the ace of cups the Sun happiness and you appear the Queen of Pentacles. Between this and this, there is one blockage. Between your Ace of Cups and their Sun, there is one blockage. And uh, this is called uh, pain. Let's see why this pain. Why? But no matter what, because I feel that uh, this is overcoming. This is. Uh, as blockage you will be away from your path because if you can see you're going to be the queen oh, the queen of pentacles you're going to be the queen of pentacles Virgo and um, also very something very hot is coming your way hot I mean sexually hot mm. Love, love, more love. Oh. Offer of love. You, Queen of Cups, love. Herfan, very spiritual person. Someone, someone, someone there is, is very spiritual person. I could even say that it could be your soulmate. But uh, there is love, there is love coming to you and you are ready to accept it. Anyway, let's see here the Ace of Cups. And we'll see more as 
we clarify deeper the energies. again as, as we said that but oh, that's good that's very good that's very good where it will lead you There are a little bit of difficult parts. I will start with the difficult parts. And the difficult part is that you have been a little bit heartbroken because you have been waiting something big to come to you uh, regarding money. Okay, you, you don't really care about this because you're very strong. But it has something to do with the promotion, could be something to do with uh, money from a bonus, let's say. You had been waiting to sell something and get lots of money, or you had invested something. This could also be, this investment could be uh, financial and also emotional, okay? And um, you didn't see it working because I see here you feel like stressed or heartbroken because you don't see the results. You didn't have the results that you have thought that you would have, and uh, to you mean the world. You are wrong. I'm just saying to you, you're wrong. First of all, I will say to you that you're going to have the Ace of Cups. And you will sit here. Um, this heartache has transformed into, into pain. And this pain also could include sex. And the energy, as we said in the beginning, that it's not playful. Like, um, like um, joyful. It is playful like... I'm here, a little bit on my left, let's go, a little bit on the right, return back. It could be some kind of, um, um, not addiction, like a game that you enjoy, could be, not joyful, but like a game that is pleasing you, still, you are getting detached from all this pain. It feels like um, someone hurt you and uh, you feel so painful. And when you woke up, you say, okay, okay, I have it. I can have it. I have uh, my offers. So I will check a little bit here and there and there and there. Deep inside of you though, I don't feel that you have been very um, pleased and happy. I don't feel so. Uh, like um, the front show, it could be, it could give you some kind of uh, pleasure, right? But uh, you know that's not for you, at least not this period. And you are getting emotionally detached. The moment that you are doing this, Virgo, the moment that you are doing this, look what is happening. Happiness is there for you. Victory and success is there for you with the Six of Wands. Success regarding money, success regarding your career, success regarding uh, your um, love life. And there is one person coming. That the results from the past, you will see them brand new. And they will be, they will take you to your stability, the, the one that you wanted. If, for example, you wanted to start something uh, some time ago and you said, oh, that shit, that investment, financial huh? or emotional, you didn't see any kind of reciprocation or whatever, coming back or results for uh, your work. No, 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 they are coming. They are coming, Virgo. And the funny thing is that, yes, yes, that person that is coming, if we're talking about love, also wants you sexually so much. What is interesting is that 
you're getting your money absolutely okay you're getting out of this energy with pain absolutely okay do it if you want it do it be playful play around uh, because you can do it that's why because now we see only two people but I will say in the past we had seen that up to four people <laughs> that you had around you like um, you're like a fortress and they try to invade uh, but uh, I see happiness with this person at the same time you have to know apart from your money apart from this person with good sex with happiness there is one more waiting for you the king of cups the king of cups that is determined and wants the success also the same with this person a little bit different that one could lead you I would say even to to marriage if you're not married okay or commitment that person is a uh, little bit more has lots of love but uh, is not thinking with mind is thinking with heart and wants you to be free to enjoy together and um, explore and discover new things that person sees you this one is looking at you as the queen of pentacles and you're becoming money and stability that person is so crazy sexually about you and that person is also promising really good time with you and that person great time celebration joy with the king of cups that sees you as an irresistible virgo that person is waiting hmm? is here waiting the one that is coming to you with uh, also good sex that could even lead to marriage and that person you are marching from the point that he has the ideas or she has the ideas and you are the grounded one this is the action you are the mind he is the mind you are the action uh, you can uh, you know you can match very well but also you can match with that person it's your choice here it's your choice I feel that yes you you'll stop you stop juggling and uh, maybe you will decide who is your real happiness it is coming to you oh, don't worry at all about this three of swords no 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 it's nothing it's nothing because the ace of cups is coming for you sun is coming for you getting out of this shit sex is coming for you with that person that could even lead to marriage or commitment and you will be very happy you're having your money and another one wants you like crazy too very cool okay so let's see your lucky number for this week hmm? Okay. Oh, so nice. So nice. So you have a number twenty four, number fifty two, number fifty five, and number one. Okay, for some of you, if you want to, to top up one more. You can add number eight. So, Virgo, thank you so much for watching. And uh, until next time that we're talking, the choice is yours. Hmm? You are the Queen of Pentacles. One, two. The choice is yours. Thank you so much. If you need to take a choice, actually, if you don't need what to take, you can have them both. And you can still have this energy. It is not a self-sabotage energy. No, you don't do it. Self-sabotaging energy. No, you don't do it to yourself. No. No, don't worry about this. It will just that will lead you uh, very faster towards your stability. Find the one that is good enough for you. Both of them, though, are very good. Both of them. Up to you. So, uh, thank you so much. Until next time, Virgo. I uh, wish you all the best. Take care of yourselves and uh, bye for now.